what's up and happy saturday to all of you guys um i started a project that i wish i had started recording much earlier today and i completely forgot until just now but we decided that we we're going to do an in tank fuel pump on the 52 gmc truck and so you can see the fuel lines already run over there there's a there's a long story about how we got to this point and i'll do a whole video on that eventually but long story short at this point the truck went to a car show went to good guys two weeks ago and uh actually i think it was last weekend anyway regardless it wouldn't start at the end of the show it wouldn't start we couldn't even get it um out of the center of the of the texas motor speedway last weekend and so started doing some research and figured out that we had a bad fuel pump fuel pump was a big that's the long story so anyway we decided to go with the tanks uh retrofit fuel pump um i believe uh there's a part number well goodness i don't have the part number right here in front of me but anyway it's the tanks retrofit i'll get the part numbers and stuff and put them in the description and then the new uh, sending unit the lmc 32 4001 uh, we've already got the uh, the sending unit cut down and ready to go for the new tank. Had to drill the tank, and uh, I've got my, my buddy Benny out here that is working on the tank as we speak. I'm walking outside to show you what's going on with that. So we've got this, this uh, LMC fuel tank, and I can't remember the exact number on it, but this LMC tank that the guy that finished uh, or that was building this thing he had a fuel pump in this hole right here. We decided to do the end tank uh, system, and so Benny and I just cut this hole out, and that tank's fuel pump, once we get that retrofitted, we'll fit in that, and uh, and hopefully we'll be good to go. Anyway, again, I just wanted to, uh, I, I forgot to shoot a video this morning, but wanted to make sure that, uh, that we kind of document this process so that those of you guys that are wanting to do the rear frame tank and the in tank fuel pump setup you can kind of see um how that uh how that takes place here so i'm gonna uh, gonna post this video and then i'll post some others once we get the tank in or once we get the uh the pump uh into the hole there and get that fitted with all the the holes drilled out and all that good stuff right now we're just getting it cleaned out getting all the metal shavings out uh, one of the things that we're going to do is put this magnet uh, leave this magnet in the bottom of the tank just to make sure that we didn't miss any of those shavings. So we'll be back. <laughs> 